morning, y'all. Look at me, it's looking like a blob. I'm bloated. It's that time of the month. I'm two pounds heavier than I usually am. King made a mess. King's always making a mess. Yeah, you gotta go whoop him. I gotta go whoop him? Yeah. <laughs> what happened to your lip? All right, you need some more chapstick? Yeah. I'll give you some more in a minute, okay? About to make these boys lunch and me lunch. Ugh, I feel like eating out today. I ate all. Stepped on the sticker. Yeah, you need to say sorry. It's thankful for all these stickers be in this house. Anyways, I really feel like eating out today, but I'm not going to because we did end up eating out. Sat well, Brian didn't eat out, but I did because I was working Saturday night, and then I got me some onion rings last night. But I feel like eating out. I don't need to be eating out. How about chicken nuggets and fries? Hot dogs and <laughs> chips, but I'm gonna eat chicken nuggets. I feel like I need to buy some actual hot dogs, y'all. Yeah. Making Frito pies for dinner. It's gonna be so yummy. Ooh, I wonder if I should make one of them things of pulled pork and do like pulled pork chili or just do pulled pork Fritos and nacho cheese. <gasps> that sounds bomb. Should I make that? I think I'm gonna make that. Anyways, I told you all what we're having for lunch. So I'm gonna make me some french fries. So I'm gonna just cut up one potato, wash it, cut it up. <gasps> Did I tell you guys last week? Your girl got the dishwasher working, girl. Mm, mm. Y'all, I'm so excited that the dishwasher worked. <laughs> So yeah, I actually, ugh, I just finished editing today's video. I'm gonna go ahead and get lunch prepped and ready. And then I'm gonna sit down, place a pickup order for Target because I don't feel like going into the store today. I feel like I, hey, stop. Put it in the trash. Or go play in your room with them. Whatever you wanna do. Go, take them and go play in your room. Take them and go play in your room. You can play with them. Take them and go play in your room. Never shut down my kid's creativity. He thinks them are drums. They're going to be drums. But, um, I, I feel like I've been doing way too much socializing and the introvert me. Because, like, I, I, I'm the type of person, and Raquel said this in her video. Like, I can go hang out with friends. I can be around people. And it doesn't bother me. But it's like, after I do that, like, I need, like, a week of not leaving the house and just being by myself. And since we went to, because it's like, even though we were around family, it was still socializing and it wasn't at our house. So I still feel really drained from our trip to Atlanta, like socially and like mentally. Like I loved the trip. The trip was so fun, but because of my personality, like I feel drained. And so like, I feel like Last week was so crazy because I was basically having to run errands and catch up from the week that we were gone, going grocery shopping, being out and about. We had church on Sunday and it was just like Saturday was the only day that we probably stayed home. But then it was like, boom, Friday night, Saturday night, Sunday night, had to work, interact with people. And so I'm just literally going to take this week. I'll probably work Wednesday night, but like today, tomorrow, <laughs> I don't want to deal with people like I may go to the gym but like I don't have to talk to people at the gym like I don't know it's so weird like I'm okay with going out as long as I don't have to talk to people if that makes sense and that's where I'm at see I'm gonna make lunch place that target pickup order cuz I don't feel like being in the store and then eat and I need to film today I really need to film today cuz I don't have any videos for tomorrow so yeah go ahead and get that done y'all so I'll see y'all in a little bit. All right, you guys, I ended up changing what I was eating because I had leftovers from whenever I made tacos on Friday night. So I just turned them into nachos. I wasn't feeling the whole taco thing. So I'm about to make my thumbnail now. My video is finishing saving. It's wrapping up as we speak. I'm gonna put it to upload. Once I'm done eating, I'm gonna lay the boys down for a nap. And then I'm gonna try to film a couple of videos. Dang it, 
I'm about to place my Target order right now. Like right now, I'm gonna place it. <laughs> All right, you guys, I'll see y'all later. We are about to go pick up Ethan. I think Brian has to work late. I didn't finish checking my messages before I got in the car. Probably should have did that. But yeah, obviously I didn't film. I still look just as rough as this morning. But yeah, we're headed out to go do our rounds of picking people up. And then I think my target order should be ready by the time we're done picking everybody up. I got a headache, I'm tired. I finished all the laundry literally just now before we got in the car. So yeah, see you guys later in a little bit. Say hi. Hi. Say hi, birthday boy. <laughs> so I just made Frito homemade Frito pies. I used just the canned um, wolf chili and then this canned cheese. No, it's not dairy free, but it's gonna be real good on these notch on these Frito pie. How's the Frito pie, babe? Hi. It's the King's birthday. We are currently waiting on his D O N U T S to come in to be delivered so we can sing him happy birthday. Cause he loves him some donuts, y'all. So we are just waiting on those to come so we can sing happy birthday. I'm probably gonna have to make some more chili cause we used it all already. So yeah, I need to sit down and eat. But yeah, watching my girl Lilo right now. Check out her channel if you haven't already. Oh, there goes my donuts. Are you ready? Yes! Don't load it. Turn it off, Bryson. Happy bird. Oh. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Hold on. You can move. Wait. Happy birthday to you. No. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear King. Happy birthday to you. Yeah, blow it out. Blow it. I just blow it for him. This is not your birthday. You do it. Now you can blow it. You do it, King. Blow it out. Do it. King, right. Good job, yay, King! Happy birthday, my baby. Grayson, say good morning. No. King, say good morning. They got their donuts still from last night. Excuse you. Well, I'll say good morning because I love y'all. My kids are bougie. So anyways, good morning. Today is for real, for real filming day. Gonna get some videos filmed and edited and all that good stuff. I placed an order for Ulta online because I needed the Clinique Cleansing Balm. Watch my November favorites if you want to know why. And so, um, anyways, I wanted to show you guys what I've been taking in the morning. In the mornings, um, I'm currently having a donut for breakfast. I'm so healthy with coffee. And I realized the second time I used this, I just said concentrate. So Allie, water it down. So that's what I've been doing and I like it a lot more. So. What? Yeah. I sure thought I was about to pull out of water, pulled out some crackers. Look. Boy's in here trying to be sneaky is what it was. Okay, so anyways. I've been taking these, I got these in an influencer box and I actually really like these vitamins, like really, really like them. Like I can feel a difference and I can see, like I can feel a difference in my body and the way it works. So I really, really like these. And then these bad boys right here. I ordered two of these when it was Black Friday. I really wanna, hope they go on sale again because I wanna order more. I get one bottle for Brian and one for me. And these are so good. Like these, like if you have trouble pooping, these are gonna make you poop, poop. 
Like, I have trouble going to the bathroom. Me, I ain't got no more trouble going to the bathroom with these. Like, not only that, but they truly do help with your appetite and just helping you, like, not feel hungry. And like I said, helps you go to the bathroom, y'all. So, let's make my ice. Let's make my iced coffee. I'm gonna start setting up to film, so I will see y'all later. All right, y'all, so I'm about to work out. I'm gonna do a Sydney Cummings workout today because Brian's asleep, he was reading, and he fell asleep. God probably told him to rest. And yeah, I'm about to do a Sydney Cummings workout, but um, I wanted to, I ended up filming, that's why I have on a full face. I always work out with makeup on. If I do my makeup, y'all don't judge me. It's been going good for me so far. Thought I'd show y'all what I got from Ulta and Target. So from Target, because I can't read, I thought that this was just a different shade of this because I've been seeing this go like around on TikTok, but this is actually just a lip primer. So, that's annoying, but I did pick up this one. And then I got this fluffy eye brush set. Those are just the brushes that it has. I also picked up this highlighter because Raquel keeps on talking about them. So I was like, okay, let me try it out. So I did go ahead and pick that up. I thought it was gonna be bigger, I don't know why. Got my Clinique Take Off The Day Cleansing Balm. And that little one actually lasts a really long time, a few months. So if you don't want to spend $31, that lasts you a few months. And then I picked, just to try, the Velour Lash Adhesive. Y'all, let me know what y'all's favorite lashes are, because I'll be on the struggle bush with, not lashes, lash glue. I'll be on the struggle bush with lash glue, so yeah, that's everything I got. So now I'm about to try to get this to work and work out what are y'all throwing around get in y'all's room uh-uh don't come in here don't come in here king go to your room is that what i need to say go to your room so yeah how to work out my phone may die in the middle of my workout but you guys will get to see up until y'all me forgetting to press record <sighs> happens way too much i just thought i recorded my entire workout and i didn't it was a good workout too, real good. I was going hard, but I guess I'll record myself working out tomorrow. <laughs> Cause y'all, I thought I was really recording myself. I went so hard and did so good. So now I'm about to go cook dinner. Hi guys. What my, is that still my dad's phone? No, it's my camera. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, Bryson pooped in my toilet and it's stained. No, go play in your room. Right, so I'm about to import this footage from these first my bags. I'm gonna put up my stuff. Hey, where do y'all play? Go put these shoes in your closet. I'm going to this footage and then go cook dinner. I'm making pulled pork, pulled pork, mashed potatoes. I don't know what else. I'll ask Brian what else he wants. Maybe a salad. I don't know why. Salad sounds good. So yeah, I'll see y'all later. I have Bible study tonight, so I don't know when later. Maybe later on the night. Maybe tomorrow. I don't know. Ideas. This is the brand of like pulled pork, pulled beef, and everything that I buy. Last time I bought pulled beef, but it's a little bit more expensive than the pulled pork. So this time I went with the pulled pork because it was a little bit cheaper and your girl was on a budget. So I'm making this homemade mashed potatoes and we 
are going to have this right here, the shells and vegan cheddar with broccoli. And I'm going to keep an eye on it this time and hopefully it comes out better. The only thing I really have to look out for in these is nuts because King is allergic to um, tree nuts. So, yeah. And that is it, you guys. That's what we're having for dinner. I'll show you guys it when we're done. And then I'll kind of just give you a glimpse of how I do my potatoes. Obviously, I wait till they're soft. But, yeah, that's it. Y'all, I did it again today. Set up the camera. Hey, y'all know what I did instead of push and record? Mm -hmm. Took a picture of the room. <laughs> I'm going to get it together, y'all. And y'all going to see me work out at some point this week. So that way I can motivate y'all to keep working out. But anyways, this is tonight's dinner. I made some baked chicken. Believe it or not, I got that crispy crust breaking it, baking it. And then... um. I pan fried, seared, steamed these in, in avocado oil and seasoned them. And then we have sweet rice. So yeah, it's gonna be super good. I just wanted to show y'all my plate before I added steak sauce to my chicken. Brian added barbecue sauce to his. I've already eaten some broccoli. It tastes delicious. Brian says it's good. Sorry I didn't vlog today. I was kind of just taking it easy. Why you got me acting all real black? What are you talking about? I said, I said before I put my steak sauce on mine, Brian put barbecue sauce on his. But you, you make sound like I'm just extra. No, black. I was just letting them know that we're both putting sauce on his You know, the chicken. black guy put barbecue sauce on his chicken. And then the boys are eating. Is it yummy, boys? <laughs> Is it yummy? I don't like You haven't even tried eating the chicken. Y'all, my kids swear they're vegetarians. Eat your food, Bryson. All right, y'all. Good night. Because after this, after dinner, I need to hurry up and eat. But after dinner, I'm going to go ahead and clean up, get the boys in bed, call it a night. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, you guys. Since Brian is doing some reading tonight, I'm going to wash my brushes while he reads. Shouldn't take too long. What always takes me the longest? What always takes me the longest is actually my sponges. But I'm about to go through and pull out all the dirty brushes and then head to the kitchen to wash them.
All right, you guys, an hour later, all of my brushes and all of my dirty, all my brushes that were dirty and all my sponges that were dirty, which were just about all of them, minus like one, are all clean. So now I get to shower and go to bed and I'm excited. So good night, y'all. Good morning, guys. So I forgot that I recorded a time lapse of my workout last night on my phone. Cause I was gonna post it last night to encourage people to work out, but then I started cooking and I got busy and stuff. So I do have my workout from last night, but look at this, you guys. So, so if you've never cleaned your makeup brushes before and you see how like some of these, hold on, I already fluffed some of them out. Um, so usually my eye brushes dry way before my thicker brushes. So I'm gonna put these up, but you see how like they kind of look deformed? You can always just fluff them out. And I do have a brush cleaning video on my channel that I'll link down below. But yeah, brushes and sponges are cleaned. But yeah, um, this is Thursday. Gotta, gotta pay some bills and just see what we need for around the house so that way I can go buy it. But yeah, I'll see you guys a little bit later after I actually wake up and get myself together. So yeah, I'll see y'all in a bit. All right, you guys, so I decided just to come to Target because there was a lot of Ibotas and a lot of coupons. And I just, I wanted to pick stuff out for myself. I know it's a lot and I don't like making them shop for a lot of stuff. Well. Not as much as it could have been, but it was a lot. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put this stuff up. And I need to take off this mask so I can breathe. Okay, so. People have been talking about this wine all over the place. So I thought I would finally try that one. And then I also got our favorite, which is just a plain old white Moscato. And then we surprisingly are all of a sudden running out of our milk super fast. I don't know if it's because of what I've been cooking or because they've been eating more cereal or what the case is. But we're going to go ahead and replenish those. I'm going to put these up and then I'll show you all the rest of the stuff that I got. Okay, just a quick little OOTD, big oversized jean jacket, NASA shirt, green biker shorts because it is going to be 75 today and my little Adidas, my little Adidas. Anyways, it's hot, y'all. Look at this hair. Oh, because of these stupid masks. Okay. Let's see. I got two of these. Because your girl be going to the bathroom and it don't be smelling good and we were out. And then, like I said, I bought these. The girl, I guess she didn't know that I was supposed to, that she was supposed to rip this off and give me that coupon for it. But now I'm going to have to save it. So I'll start using these because Jessica Braun. And then restock on some toothpaste because I just pulled ours out from under the sink. And Brad and I are extra and we do use two different toothpaste so we use the charcoal one for whitening and then we use the native one for whitening and then i got this for brian's hands because his hands are so so rough and he's really been like i think he's been starting to get like not insecure about it but it's starting to bother him got the boys two vitamins because okay so listen to this I bought these, well, for one, because I thought I was going to get the coupon off that she didn't do, but also it was um, a thing on Ibotta. These were on Ibotta, so I'll be getting money back for those. I bought two, just so that way we don't run out anytime soon. Oh, I forgot to put this heavy cream in the fridge. But I bought heavy cream. We are currently using this lotion, and it smells so good. bought it just because I took our lotion out from under the sink, and I always like to keep one just as backup. I don't, I don't like to have to like go to the store like in a hurry like, oh man, we're out of lotion. So if I pull out my backup, I always go replace my backup. Same thing with shampoo and conditioner. Also had a coupon for these and I think, I think these were on Ibotta. I can't remember. Now for sure, I'm running out of my face cleaner and like I said, I don't like to run out of stuff. Didn't have a backup so I bought this one because it's on Ibotta. 
I brought I bought these um, skin balancing. These are just, just my cellar cleansing cloths. Um, really for my makeup and whenever I'm filming. So, and these were on Ibotta too. These weren't on Ibotta, but this one is for Brian because this one smells like a man. This one actually smells really good. And yes, they are aluminum free. So I got those. So this one's for Brian. I bought that one for me because it smells kind of girly, honestly. Back up for the kids toothpaste. They actually had a $1 coupon on, um, they had a $1 off coupon for Tom's of Maine on, I believe it was the app, the Target Cartwheel app. Okay, panty liners, because my time of the month is not heavy enough for pads sometimes. Like this month that just passed, I, I'm currently off of it, like just got off like the day before yesterday was my last day. And it just was not heavy enough for pads. So I was like, you know what? Let me just get some liners for the next time it's like that. And then I had a 15% off coupon for these. And there's a redeemable thing on it for them on Ibotta. So I'll be getting cash back and I got money off. And then the next thing for just for me, um, I got these, these Holler and Glow Mask. I got these off a of Juicy Jazz recommendation. And they were actually really good i'm gonna do my feet and do like the scraper thing i call it the cheese grater i'm gonna do the cheese grater on my feet and then i'm gonna put the sock mask on and then i got this one just for afterwards because you can only do these six to uh i believe every six to eight weeks so every <laughs> every two months you can do that every two to three months and then i bought this one just for in between so these you actually leave on your feet 60 to 90 minutes the longer the better so i'm not going to do this today i am going to actually scrape my feet today but i'll probably do this like as soon as i get back from dropping off brian tomorrow morning and i'll leave it on from 6 30 to till we, we have to get ready to leave the house because you do have to wash it off so yeah that is my little my little target haul y'all that's everything that we got oh and then i also got the tide pods i got the snuggle liquid fabric conditioner um, because like I said, Tide Pods, I had, um, Tide Pods, I had a $1 off coupon for, for the tar from the Target car Cartwheel app, as well as I had a dollar cash back for any detergent, um, laundry detergent on Ibotta. And then I got the Snuggle liquid softener because cash back on Ibotta. And I took out, um... Uh, I took my backups out from the garage of laundry detergent and fabric softener this week. So I had to buy my replacement. Same thing with, I bought bounty paper towels because I took my backups out of the garage. So I had to replace it. And then the same thing with toilet paper. Bought toilet paper because I took my backups out and I had to replace it. And that's basically everything I got from Target. So I did do my read and writing this morning. I just didn't get the chance to put it up. So now I'm going to import this footage. Get the boys some breakfast and get me some breakfast because I'm starting to feel sick. And yeah, go on about my day. Get some get tomorrow's vlog edited or what I can of it. And then yeah, just chill and hang out here at home after I put all this stuff up. So I'll see you guys later. Bye. These two things, but I also got a cuticle oil just because y'all look at these cuticles. But it's also for your nails. So I did go ahead and pick that up. It's just the Sally Hansen one. It's honestly the only one I could find at Target. And then I picked up this weekly planner. I was going to get a, like a yearly one. But I figured weekly is best for me. You know, I could just figure out like, okay, let's go ahead and think about next week. What videos do I want to get up? Or like, let's think about this week. What do I want to film so that way I can get my videos up next week? And this was in the Target um spot section and it was only three dollars so i thought it was cute matches my my theme and everything for my background so yeah now that is a complete target haul hi guys so we are headed to the gym and then after the gym i'm gonna work brian's going to bible study yeah and then i already cooked dinner so as soon as we're done doing all that we're doing we can just go home eat and everybody can go to bed but right now we are headed to the gym. So I'll see you guys when we get there. Hopefully I remember to actually press record and not just take pictures or not press anything at all. Sit back, you already know what my issue is with you.
funny. Hey guys, so I thought that I would do today's portion of the workout in this vlog a little bit different and do a voiceover. So on this day, we actually started out with about five minutes worth of cardio, and so I did the bike and Brian decided to run. Okay, so after the cardio, we did go ahead and decide to do a little bit of chest. We, we ended up doing a full body workout this day, so we did decline press, and then we also did just a regular flat chest press, and we just did three sets of each, and we just max out on reps until our arms and chest can't go anymore. So on the days that we decide to do a full body, we do randomly throw abs in there. So I did like the standing ab machine where you just lift up your legs and then we kind of go back and forth. We did some single arm dumbbell curls and then I got down and I did some Russian twist and I just did that between the sets of this uh, single arm dumbbell curls. So after we did the single arm dumbbell curls, we went into just hammer curls. Now I really like hammer curls because they don't only get your biceps, but you also get your triceps at the same time. And between the hammer curls, my ab workouts were the side crunches with a 25 pound kettlebell. And these really work if you make sure to not let your hips lean side to side, but keep them straight and flex your muscles to pull yourself back up. Don't just swing your body side to side, but actually flex and focus on the crunch. So after we did biceps, we did go ahead and move into back. So right here, we are just gonna go ahead and do the lateral pull down. And I learned with these workouts that if you literally flex the muscle as you're pulling down, flex the muscles in your back, that's how you are activating those muscles to get the best workout possible. And after we did the lateral pull downs, we go over here, and I don't know exactly what this is called. It's like, it's like a back press pull kind of deal but I those are really hard and really heavy but like I said the same thing like with the pull downs flex the muscles to pull the bar up and that's how you activate those muscles So of course after back, you know that we gotta go ahead and move into the triceps and some more ab workouts. So for triceps, we did do dumbbell overhead extensions and then I did tricep kickbacks and then I laid on the bench and did leg raises and they, these work and hurt so much better if you do it slow and controlled rather than fast. So don't let your legs just slam down but control the control your legs on the way down and then flex your abs to pull your legs back up and I promise you you will have sore abs for days. Okay, so to wrap up this workout, Brian actually didn't do this part with me. I did it because I felt like I was becoming a flat back Betty and I'm really trying to be a bubble butt Betty. So I did some glute raises um, with the 25 pound weight on my hips and then I did go ahead and do some leg extension and um, raises and then kick out to the side just to activate those glutes. All right, you guys, and then just to wrap up our workout, we did go ahead and head to the cardio room, and we did 10 to 15 more minutes of cardio, and then we did go ahead and wrap it up. Let me know if you guys try these workouts, and if you like this style of workouts in the vlog, rather than me just inserting the screen in music.
like yesterday with me actually taking my tripod to the gym. People kept looking at me like I was crazy, but I was like, you know what? This is actually going somewhere. Like YouTube is starting to take off. So I'm getting all the ugly stares cause I'm about to get real serious about vlogging y'all. And real, real, real serious about my channel. That's why I bought this little planner. See what I got for the week. I, I forgot I need to actually buy an actual planner. And then Layla posted one that she got on from Target, so I might go back and try to find that one. But um, that can be like for my channel, but for like my actual everyday life, I really do need a planner. But I do like this one because like, since it is weekly, just write, write the numbers in yourself. See what you have planned. This says, Name one person who inspires you, list one thing you really want to do, list one place you really like to visit, and then weekly goals. So, that's that. But yeah, I'm about to fix my bed, and then I'm gonna sit down and start working. So, yeah, I already said, actually I need to fix my hair. Don't know what I'm doing with my hair today, but I need to fix it. But yeah, I'm about to fix the bed, and then, you know, going about my day. Can I have my drink back? I thought you wouldn't like it because there's no cream. Thank you. Cream I'm about to add since they forgot my creamer. Like I said, it was probably for the best because I don't think that um, I don't think that Dunkin' Donuts vanilla cream is actually non-dairy so it's probably best that they forgot it. it means i really shouldn't be having no stomach pains today but yeah so woot woot. added my little bit of cream gotta mix it in because this creamer this cream a little thick like i gotta mix for a while but i'm about to mix this up i ordered me some food because the boys ate what i ordered me to eat from dunkin donuts and then I'm gonna sit down and start editing while I wait on my food. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. See y'all, I knew when I bought it, it was a little too dark. That's the color. That's the color I was looking for. This way, yeah, there we go. I knew it was a little too dark when she handed it to me. <laughs> That's the color I was looking for. But it was still good. Brian tasted it. His description was perfect. He said it tasted like coffee and tea together and i was like huh that's a perfect description boy that my creamer tastes way better in there than that um than that vanilla creamer that they have mm, mm, mm. that's real good all right you guys i got home from working at about 8 40 9 o'clock um i'm currently going to do a pamper night Hence the headband, about to run me a bath with that Epsom salts and bubbles, that bath bomb. And drink me a little glass of wine, put on a mask, do a lip scrub, do all the things and call it a night, y'all. Um, I don't have much planned for the weekend. Tomorrow is hired to do somebody's makeup and then I'll work tomorrow night. And then I'll work Sunday night and church on Sunday and yeah, so. That is what my weekend's going to consist of. So I just wanted to end the vlog while I remembered. So I love you guys. But always remember that Jesus loves you more. If you haven't already, please go ahead and give this a thumb up, thumbs up. Also, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Hey guys, so I went ahead and just for the month of December, decided to go ahead and show you every day. So, um, yeah, I'm about to work out right now. I just sat the boys down for breakfast. I wasn't gonna work out this morning, but then I got on the scale and seen I was down two more pounds. So every time I see that number go down, I'm like, yes, Allie, your, your work is paying off. Keep going. And then there's sometimes the scale doesn't move at all or will actually go up. But then I'm like, Allie, you know where you wanna be. Keep going. So some, the, the scale defeats some people. For me, it, it, to, for me, it motivates me. So I'm about to work out right now. Just sat the boys down for breakfast. I'm going to do like a 30 minute workout, 30 to 40 minute. We'll see what I feel like doing on Sydney Cummings channel. And yeah. And then after that, I'm going to wash my face, get ready for the day, film a video. That girl comes over for me to do her makeup at four. 
And then I think Brian's gonna go try to see if we can get a second car, if it's in the budget, because it's not that we can't get one because we've been approved. It's just, we haven't found something that works with our budget. So we're trying to find something that's in the budget. So keep us lifted in your prayers. So yeah, let's go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and do this workout. I'm not gonna film it because even though I'm showing you guys today, it's going to be very little of today because my, this vlog is already like four hours long, y'all. So that I have to edit. You won't watch four hours, but I have to edit four hours of footage, time lapse, a whole lot of stuff. And that's how I'm able to get it down to 30 and 40 minutes for you guys to watch. So if you watch my vlogs, thank you because work does go into those. But I'm about to work out and then wash my face, film. At some point, I need to eat breakfast. I'll probably eat another. I'll probably eat a yogurt. And then call it a day for breakfast. Probably, mmm. I should eat some yogurt and cut up some apples and dip the apples in the yogurt. Huh? That sounds real good. That might be what I do. So I might eat apples and vanilla yogurt. And then, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do right now. Um, I just finished my read and write the word as well. And so, yeah, gonna go ahead and do that workout. And I don't know what time Brian's getting home, so I gotta hurry. So I'll see you guys later. All right, y'all, we did it. Brian got his truck. What a blessing. God is so good to us. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know if y'all can see him, but he got his truck, y'all. So now we got two cars. He said, well, just share cars, basically. So, yeah, we're about to, I'm just about to start doing Uber Eats. He's about to start doing a favor, and then we'll meet back here at the house at 9.30, I believe. 9.30, 10 o'clock. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Pray for me. Hopefully tonight's a better night with Uber. So, yeah. See you guys later. Or actually, I'm ending the vlog here. So, thank you guys for watching this vlog. If you haven't already, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah.